or render render correctly so me because I, I had to look into this right you know i'm like why is so i looked into it and there's a reddit post someone like hey am i crazy you know or is this rom always producing a shiny froki and then the, the number you know the number one comment there to help with that is you got to change this setting and it's like one of the renderers or something like that and yes yes when i read that and when i seen my second shiny froki what i thought was a second shiny froki i was like there's no fucking way there's no way i get three shinies in a day in two in the same game both starters one in a different game and a starter there's just no fucking way so i you know my 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 heart was broken whenever i found out that no it's just a rendering error in the emulator and that's just it's just that's all it is not anything else just a mess up and i've yet to tell my friend that i've yet to tell my friend this has been days now it's been days since i told him about me getting extremely lucky he was all like you should buy a lottery ticket and you know joking around with me of course but I just don't, I, I don't know if I have the heart to tell him that, hey, that wasn't a shiny. Because when I think about it, I relive that horror. I'm like, ah, oh, no. But at the same time, I did get shiny Litten. So like, even though I got shiny Froakie, imposter version, I did get shiny Litten. So that's pretty fucking awesome. I got what I wanted. Yeah, at the same time, uh, what I ended up doing was uh, saving. Uh, I ended up because like I'm playing on emulators, so all I did was instead of trying to trade with myself because it was more complicated process, considering the different uh, emulators that I was using and which versions of them, which builds of the emulator that I was using. So I went instead and just used Pokehex, and I just went and took the shiny Litten from my Pokemon Sun. Uh, file just took him saved him to my computer so now he exists and from that save file but the original save file is gone because I I did still want the different um, starters so I wanted Litten fuck I can't even think of the other ones now Poplio and it's there I can see it Fuck, what is it? I can't think of what it is. Rowlet. Nailed it. Yeah, so I wanted those ones for my playthrough in Sun. Cause or well it ended up being Ultra Sun. I was playing I was originally gonna do Sun, but I was like after reading more about like which version because the reason why I wanted to do certain versions was that I really want to be able to catch as many Pokemon as I can in a singular game not because i'm playing on emulators so i don't i don't want to have to worry about trading and i don't want to have to worry about like oh you missed out on this or you know these event pokemon no i just want to play the game and catch as many pokemans as i can and so like uh, i see people talk about x and y with alpha sapphire and omega ruby and i see people talking about those games and then Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. There's another one. There's another one that's added. Um, those lists are older. So like they're like a couple of a few years. A couple to a few years old now. So like they don't necessarily list like Pokemon Legends. Just to fill you in. We are looking for Jigglypuff right now. That's what's happening. It says Jigglypuff is available in this area. But we'll see. But yes, anyways, so it wasn't a shiny Froki. It was just a rendering issue with the emulator. And um Yeah, so my heart was broken. But I did get my shiny Litten, which is cool. I saved him, and he exists in another save. Uh, like I have the original Litten and then he exists in another save file 
for my Ultra Sun playthrough that I'm thinking that I'm not going to really play through it because the more I started playing Ultra Sun, I put, I'd say, three hours into it, but I didn't even go into the school yet. I was just like trying to find P2, trying to capture all the Pokemon that I could before moving on to that part, kind of like what I'm doing right now. And um, in doing that, though, I started to realize that like these are all new Pokemon. These are new moves. This is a whole new story. It's a whole new area. New characters. Like, I mean, it's literally a new game for me. And yes, it's an older game now. But I was like, I kind of want to do a, like, I kind of want to play through this game blind and not know and not have, you know, a shiny starter, which I might still end up doing because, I mean, come on now. It's it's shiny Litten. Like, come on. It, it, it took a lot, right? It did take a lot because I was running the game four times in the emulator, four instances, and just soft resetting over and over and over for hours, which other people do that with the original hardware. And I can only imagine what that's like, you know, doing that on two uh, 3DS XLs, having a soft reset for that. But I think that's why people were always mentioning that they have a rubber band on it, I guess, so that it's easy for them to quickly soft reset. That'd be my guess. But yeah, in doing this, eventually I would like to get original hardware and have these games to play on. That would be really fucking cool. That's that's like a, a dream for later on, though. It's not necessarily like, it's got to happen tomorrow or next week. I mean, it'd be cool if it did, but I'm just saying realistically that's something for later on and i'm working towards that kind of like how we're working towards this jigglypuff but so far the progress has been slow but you know here's the nice thing though that i know that this is going to be an enjoyable ride that Dunspar showing up and it being female and me being excited for that, that is promising, right? Like, think about this. Right here, here, here's something to share. When I play other games, you know, it's like got cool moments in them, but there's a part of me that just this collection part of me, that's just like, well, yeah, I mean, I'm, they're just, just pixels on a screen. They're just ones and zeros. Yet, there's something satisfying about finding your favorite Pokemon or stumbling upon your least favorite Pokemon, but it being part of the collection that you need. And so you just, you still need to get it. So you're happy to see them. That was earlier. And I think that's something that, um, it's a good way to remind myself by playing these games. Is it like, yeah, man, just enjoy it. Enjoy it for, you know, what it is. It doesn't have to be any more or any less. It's just, just take it for what it is. And that right now is I have time to record. I have time to play video games. So rather than not utilize that time, rather than let that time literally slip away into nothingness, well... Shouldn't I be fucking doing something that I enjoy? Yes. Yes, I should. Absolutely. And there'll be days where like, you know, I wanted to record. I wanted to record something. And then I was like, but I don't know what. And I was like, I really don't want to play necessarily like Alan Wake 2 and record that. Not to say that I won't do that. <gasps> yes. Yes. Okay. Is it going to be female? Female? Yes. Yes, it fucking is. Fuck yeah. Okay. Fuck yeah. All right, Caterpie. Do your thing. Tackle that Jigglypuff. Somebody stop that Jigglypuff. Oh, fuck yeah. Sing doesn't bother me. Can't sing me to sleep. Sorry, Jigglypuff. Now here's the... Oh, no. What? 
No, no, no. It's fine. I think we're... It's okay. Caterplea... Cater... Caterplea? Caterpie needs to sleep anyways. Get you a nap in. Here we go. We're gonna go for it. Come on. Come on. Yeah, he's already asleep. What do you think you're doing? Silly goose. Come on. Don't, don't let me use these all up, please. Even then, I think we have all the Pokemon we can catch so far. One, two, three shakes. Three shakes. Thank you. Thank ya. Female Jigglypuff. Fuck yeah. First Jigglypuff we've seen, and it's the female one. Winning. If it inflates to sing a lullaby, it can perform longer and can cause sure drowsiness in its audience. Balloon. Um. No. Sweet. Alrighty. Okay. Now I believe that was the, that's the Pokemon we can get. Um, hold on, let's see here. Uh, oh, another Jigglypuff? Holy shit! What the fuck? <laughs> back to back Jigglypuffs? Um, I mean, there's really no reason to. I guess we could fight it. Oh, wait, no. Let's just run. Oh, Hoot Hoot. We can't get Hoot Hoot yet. We still got, still got hours before that can happen. I think it said 559 is what counts as night. We're definitely going to go heal up and save now. Now, if I was doing the oak challenge thing, then Jigglypuff uh, can actually be... Uh, actually do that this guide that I'm using to see where Pokemon are and where you can catch them early uh, this it lets you know it basically kind of explains to you how you can get a moonstone for for Jigglypuff before you normally would which is really cool but that's a lot to do and I'm not gonna do that <laughs> just so that we're you know at an understanding okay uh, oh, right. Um, let's see here. This. Pokedex. That's what we've seen. We've seen 10 Pokemon. Which, this is, so that's, uh, one that we can't get. Metapod. Need our, we can't get Weedle. Weedle's, uh, version exclusive to Silver. Okay, is this everything? Okay, yeah. So we just need to get our Caterpie to evolve into Metapod. All right. Well, that's what we'll do then. Let's get our Caterpie into Metapod. Even though I may have the time to do this, I also got to keep in mind that I have to keep in mind that uh, I may want to not make the video super long. Oh, yeah, we're going to fight it because we're trying to get as much XP as we can for now. Come on, Caterpie. How can you miss with them big old eyes? A critical.
every time in like whenever these early battles it makes you think of uh pokemon the first movie whenever pikachu is having the slap fight with pikachu the clone pikachu they're just slapping each other back and forth and it's like that's what this kind of it reminds me of that that imagery comes to mind whenever playing this game in these early battles and you just tackle 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 I mean, do we go back or do we just keep pushing forward to we'll just keep going forward we'll make it there nice why yes please Okay. Now we're going to go out here to this tall grass and see if we can buff up Caterpie. Or we could kind of, you know, just kind of catch us a level six Metapod. How is this Metapod level six? What? How are you level six Metapod? My Caterpie's level six and he's not even a Metapod. That this is the this is like the main character Metapod then, right? Because like if this one's like a level six Metapod and my Caterpie's level six, then there's something something wrong with my Caterpie. It is really too bad about no bee drill, no no weedle. And don't get me wrong, I'm I like my my butterfree, but I also like bee drill. Bee drill is cool. Not really a bug Pokemon, but trainer. But if I was to pick some, yeah, I like me a bee drill. All these burbs. It's hard out here for a caterpie. Actually, you know, we're just we're just gonna run. We're not gonna take the time to switch out, fight a Pidgey. Is it more efficient? I don't know. Honestly, I don't. But this is good. Fighting more Metapods? See, this is Metapods level 5. Something's up, Caterpie. What's up? Why are you level 6, but you're not Metapod yet? <laughs> uh-huh. I like it. I just gotta say, man, that battle music, though, is just top-notch. Wait, not Caterpie? Man, I figured Caterpie would've stepped up in the world by now. This is the one. Oh, yeah, about to have a, a tackle match right here. You're getting all the XP. This is the one that's gonna make you a Metapod. Look, he's even helping you out. Wrapping you up already. Getting you ready for your cocoon.
imagine if this if there was like a version of this game not like a whole different not like this game never existed but rather like a version of this where it's kind of like the show where you don't really have levels but like pokemon just end up evolving based because like think about it like there was you could argue like oh it was because they reached that level so that's why they evolved but like we don't ever know that you know in the show specifically well at least from what i've seen so it'd be kind of cool if there was like a version of the games that kind of worked like that but they kind of did something like that with like in this game where like you know you have happiness or like mood evolutions so like if your pokemon uh is happy with you it'll evolve into the next form with like uh golbat into crobat or something like that is that what it's called there we go caterpie's level seven now beautiful what caterpie is evolving look at this metamorphosis happening oh yeah congratulations your caterpie evolved into metapod the nice thing about having the metapod uh, uh caterpie evolving into metapod is that he can still fight but I don't 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 I don't 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 but I don't 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 okay let's heal up yes please so let's see what we could have caught by now is a Pidgey have it Centret have it Hoot Hoot don't have it Radita we have it Geodude, Jigglypuff, Spiro. And then for the version specific, which is gold version, Caterpo Caterpie, Caterpod. Anyways, Caterpie. And we just got our Metapod. And then Spinarak also shows up, but doesn't show up until nighttime. Um. And then eventually we can catch a Bell Sprout. It looks like, well, if we keep going, we can actually capture a bell sprout. Um, Ghastly. Oh, Ghastly's only at night. And Onyx, we can trade for an Onyx. So, maybe, because this video is like, it's going to be long. It's going to be a long one real long one which is what I wanted yeah we're at 2 hours and 27 minutes the video is probably a little bit longer than that maybe not by much anyways though yeah so this is what we managed to do I've already read them off but in case you want to see them instead of me just reading it Chikorita we've seen a Cyndaquil We've seen, or we've caught Pidgey, Spiro, Rattata, Centret, a Caterpie. We have a Metapod, Geodude, Zubat, and a Jigglypuff, and a Dunsparce. Dunsparce or Dunsparce? Either way, we got it. Low chance to see it, and the one we got ended up being female. It's great. Look at that. We can't print. Anyway, though, we're going to go ahead and stop here. I already saved, but we're going to save again. But anyway, I hope you're having a good day or night, depending on when you watch this. And as always, thanks for watching.